Hey guys, welcome to question MM277 of the Maths Methods 4 to 5 study guide. So in this question we've got, let f be a function with an average value of 4 over the interval 0 to 10. The graph of f over this interval could be. Alright, guys, there's multiple ways to work this out. Um, there is one way where you could figure out the equation of each one of these uh, and then basically figure out the average value from there. But the, the essential thing with an average value is that the area between the line y equals 4 and the graph is gonna be the same on either side of the average value. Okay, so what I mean by that is, this is a bad example because I'm not gonna be able to illustrate it properly, but let's go with B for a second. So the average value of four means that the area between here and here, and then after this crossover point here to here is gonna be the same, okay? So at our split point, which is four in this case, because our average value is four, we have to look and say, is this area the same as this? And if it is, then that's our average value. If it's not, it's not our average value. This triangle is much smaller than this one, so B is not gonna be our answer. Now, four has just this uh, area under here. It actually has no area on the other side, so it's it's not definitely not gonna be our average value because the average value should be somewhere down here where the um, area on either side should be there. Uh, C, <coughs> our average value of four means that this area above and this area above should equal this area plus this area, which it's not, right? Because this and this is much smaller than this and this. And it doesn't really look like that on my diagram, but if you did it on your paper, you'd see that uh, these two areas are much bigger than these two areas. Actually, sorry, that's not right. It's these, my bad. It's these two, this area here. So you can see that this area is much bigger than these two, which means that our average value is not going to be 4. D, um, our, average our average value means that the area between here and our area between here should be the same, right? Uh, which it is, okay? So we can see that this and this are the same. Again, might not look like it on my diagram, but if you do this on your um, actual scaled proper graphs, you'll see that. So we can see that D is going to be our answer, and we can even check this one as well, which means that this area should be the same as this area if it's the if the average value is 4, but we can easily see that that's much bigger than that, so it's not our average value. So guys, D is our correct answer for this. Um, this is kind of a trial and error question, uh, but as you get more used to the average value uh, feeling, then you'll, you'll be able to pick it up a bit quicker. So that's the end of MM277. If you have any questions, please hit me up in the comments below. Uh, but otherwise, thanks for watching and see you in the next video.